things are about to get cheesy. It's really good to hear your voice saying my name. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 cheesiest one hit wonders of the 2000s. Even though the gods are crazy, even though the stars are blind. For this list, we've chosen acts that were strongly identified with one extremely cheesy but successful song during the 2000s. Limiting things to acts that literally only had one hit single throughout their entire careers, but we're picking acts that are most known today for one chosen song. And for the record, we're not saying these songs are bad, but there's a certain fromage factor to them that helps them stand out. Number 10. All the Things She Said, Tattoo Never underestimate the effect faux lesbian antics can play on the libido of the teenage male. Highly controversial for the schoolgirl outfits and lipstick lesbian imagery in its music video, combined with an undeniably infectious beat, this Russian duo had a surefire equation for international attention. Starting in about 30 countries, with further success in some locations, especially their homeland, this song will go down in history worldwide due to its controversy. Number 9. He Loves You Not, Dream when Diddy was known for his musical influence and style, instead of his business acumen, when he tapped an act as the next big thing, his track record was solid. When Dream hit the charts with their debut single, it seemed like they could be the next Spice Girls, or at least exhibit some staying power. So free to do what he wants. Alas, was not the case. He loves me. Starting in America, Canada, New Zealand, Australia, and the UK, it was the toe-tapping catchiness of this song's beat, combined with the memorable music video, that earned it a place in our memories and on our list. Number 8. Wherever You Will Go, The Calling So lately, been wondering be there to take my place. Despite reforming in 2013 with mostly new members, The Calling has yet to escape the legacy of their one true hit, and most likely never will. Their debut single managed to dominate new rock radio and charts worldwide for a decent run before fading away after their second album failed to reclaim the same acclaim. Though their time in the sun was short, their notoriety lives on, with the song that brought them fame remaining a staple of a lot of radio playlists worldwide. Number 7. Stars Are Blind, Paris Hilton I don't mind spending some time. Any self-respecting music fan may shudder to recall it, but there was a time when Paris Hilton, the woman known for her partying antics and sex tape, charted in the top five in five different countries. Even though the gods are crazy, even though the stars are Attempting to be taken seriously as a musician may have eluded her, but this reggae-influenced pop number managed to make her famous for a moment of her life for something legit. Yeah, 
almost had it, Paris. Number six, Heaven, DJ Sammy. I'm finding it hard to believe we're in heaven. Sampling a 1985 Brian Adams song. I'm finding it hard to believe we're in heaven. This 2002 reworking reached heights never before seen by this Spanish DJ, and it defined his legacy. We're in heaven. Earning three other top 10 hits, all of his other successes were easily eclipsed by this certified gold achievement. When you lie in my eyes, Hitting the number one slot on the UK singles chart and the top 10 of the Billboard Hot 100, the ultimate testament of the staying power of this song was the fact that it re-entered the charts five years after its initial release. Number five, Lips of an Angel, Hinder. Honey, why are you calling me so late? Reaching the top position on the US Billboard mainstream chart, Lips of an Angel's lyrics about lost and secret love spoke to a lot of people in North America. Coming from the lips of an angel, those words, it makes me Despite being mocked or even loathed among certain groups of music fans for its cheesy, overwrought style, Hinder was inducted into the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame based largely, if not solely, on the magnitude of this one hit song. Four, the ketchup song, A Sarah Hey, Lost Ketchup. A pop group remembered for an infectious beat that conquered the world and a peculiar obsession with a certain condiment, Lost Ketchup took the music world by storm against all odds. Selling over 7 million copies worldwide, the song's success crossed cultural and language barriers with both English and Spanish versions, while still managing the feat of becoming the sixth best-selling single in the history of France to that point. Three, graduation, friends forever, vitamin C. So we talked all night about the rest of our lives. Where we're gonna be when we turn 25. Initially released on an album in 1999, this single was released and hit the charts in 2000 and worked perfectly as the snapshot of the end of one decade and the beginning of another. in North America and across the pond, there is something about this song that practically forces you to reflect on your life upon hearing it. I guess I thought that this would never end, and suddenly it's like the women and men. Will the past be a shadow that will follow us around? Continuing to remind many people of their youth on the rare occasion that they hear it, this prom or graduation staple has stood the test of time because of its unapologetically bittersweet tone. Two, butterfly, crazy town. Come, my lady, come, come, my lady, you're my butterfly, sugar, baby. On the other hand of the aging spectrum, butterfly is so mired in the sound of its time that it's arguably the most kitsch song on this or any list. I don't deserve you in essence. Some kind of hidden message to show me life is precious, and I guess it's true. But to tell the truth, I really never knew till I'm a you. See, I was lost and confused, twisted and used. Taking the rap rock genre to its most dull and melodic end. Crazy Town may have had a chance to maintain their stature in the music scene if every other song on their album had been much harsher and obtuse. Crazy. 
Come, my lady, come, come, my lady. Give my butterfly sugar. Charting at number one in 15 countries across the planet, Butterfly was a massive hit nonetheless. Come and dance with me. 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 Before we reveal our number one pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Because you had a bad day, you take it one down. You sing a sad song just to turn it around. Who Let the Dogs Out, Baja Men. The archetype of the one-hit wonder, the Baja Men hit it big with one song and have worked diligently to reach those peaks again with no success. This hit has somehow managed to become a regular feature at a slew of sporting events, despite the fact that the target audience of those events is full of the last people you'd expect to enjoy the track. Ranked the third most annoying song of all time by Rolling Stone, many consider it one of the worst songs of all time, but it puts a smile on the faces of just as many. Do you agree with our list? What the hell? What's your favorite cheesy one-hit wonder of the 2000s? With my girl, bad for, your health, for more music top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Oh, those